In Sunday's installment of BBC Breakfast, presenters Ben Thompson and Nina Warhurst spoke to independent dog rescue owner Emma Billingham. During their conversation, they spoke about some of the disabled dogs' first trip to the beach. However, with two of the dogs joining her in the studio, viewers were left distracted. Emma appeared on the show after footage of a few pooches from the charity Dogs for Rescue enjoying a trip to the seaside captured the hearts of the nation. The charity, who offers a home to disabled dogs from around the world, went to Formby Beach as viewers learnt in a pre-recorded clip a bit more about the work the team in Manchester do. Learning about some of the injuries the dogs in their care have fallen victim to. The show played a clip of Laika, who was the first dog they rescued back in 2013. The sweet pooch had sadly been shot by a restaurant owner in Bulgaria and is now the charity's therapy dog to help frightened children. They also introduced one of their newest residents, Clive, who was saved from Bahrain from tick fever which resulted in the loss of one of his legs. Speaking about the charity and what they do to help disabled dogs who come in from other countries, Emma was in the studio with Nina and Ben. Joining her were two black dogs called Lollipop and Bran who stole the hearts of viewers watching. Gavin Evs commented, Oh my god them disabled dogs are absolutely gorgeous hashtag breakfast. Valley All Black added, Wonderful to see at Dogs for a Rescue on hashtag breakfast. Disabled dogs living their best life. ITT3935418 tweeted, All oh, those dogs with disabilities. She later added, Oh absolutely gorgeous sick, hashtag breakfast. Responding to a tweet from the charity about their appearance on the show, Lisa Claire Reed too called the pooches, superstars. With Sandy Proctor adding, everyone's going to crazy in love with them and the rescue. Wanting to learn more about their two furry guests, Ben questioned what had happened to them as Emma explained their injuries. Viewers learned Bran was run over in Spain and was left by the side of the road where he was then rescued days later by a local. Although they were unaware fully what had happened to Lollipop, Emma commented it was most likely they'd also been hit by a car as his legs were amputated. Nina questioned, I would imagine like humans, dogs that endure trauma like that will respond and evolve in different ways. How do they react to being taken into care? To being loved again? Emma replied, absolutely fine, they're the happiest dogs. I don't know what it is about them. We've got quite a few of our disabled dogs and they're just so joyous. They seem to love life and accept everything more than anyone. I can't imagine two of our others coming into a studio and being able to cope with all the lights and everything that's going on. They don't think there's anything wrong with them at all, they just love every minute of every day. BBC Breakfast continues weekdays on BBC One from 6am.